Hey everyone, thanks for joining us for the Crosswalk Devotional Podcast. Over the years, our editorial team at Crosswalk.com has written these devotionals, observing truths we see at the intersection of faith and life. We're thrilled to offer them to you now in podcast form. To get all of these episodes straight to your phone each week, just subscribe on iTunes or wherever you get podcasts. To find more devotional content like this, just visit us at Crosswalk.com. New Creations by Ryan Duncan, read by Sean McAvoy. 1 Peter 1.23 For you have been born again, not of perishable seed, but of imperishable, through the living and enduring Word of God. Have you ever done something embarrassing? I know I have. In fact, you could say my entire childhood, and a good portion of my adult life, has been one long string of embarrassing moments. I am still haunted by the memory of when I threw up during my English final, or the time I tripped while skiing and caused a massive 10-man pileup in front of the ski lift. The worst part is, your brain never lets you forget it. The difficult news is it's not just embarrassing moments we seem unable to forget, it's our mistakes. Many of us have done things in our lives that we regret. We've acted selfishly or violently, and other people have been hurt because of it. The devil loves to use our past mistakes against us. They are, by far, his favorite weapons. He will always wait until we're vulnerable, then take our dirty laundry and rub it in our face. It's at moments like these that I always turn to 2 Corinthians 5, 17-19 and remind myself about the truth behind Christ's ministry. Therefore, if anyone is in Christ, he is a new creation. The old has gone, the new has come. All this is from God, who reconciled us to himself through Christ and gave us the ministry of reconciliation, that God was reconciling the world to himself in Christ, not counting men's sins against them, and he has committed to us the message of reconciliation. When we choose to follow Christ, our slates are instantly wiped clean. All the mistakes we've made, all the stupid things we've done, embarrassing or otherwise, no longer matter to God. We may still have to accept the consequences of our actions, but we can take comfort in knowing that in God's sight we are new creations. So do not allow Satan to guilt you with past mistakes. You are a child of God, and he will never see you as anything less. Intersecting Faith and Life Take a moment to read your Bible and reflect on God's words. And for further reading, check out 2 Corinthians 5. Hey listeners, thanks for joining us for the Crosswalk.com devotional podcast. To get all of our episodes straight to your phone during the week, subscribe to this podcast on iTunes or wherever you listen to podcasts. To find more devotional content like this, head over to Crosswalk.com.